newspaper? <laughs> you can't call that thing a newspaper. <laughs> you scribble on anything you find. And you call yourself a reporter. They serve yesterday. Ready for some shopping? Pea soup. That's pretty impressive. Snazzy. Won't want to mess with you. Let's find business the with you. Having the power of a gun will change the tide of the war. I hear the PK engineers will get through. Electric track. I was on patrol at the time. By the time no it was over. No. Halt! Biomarker. Oh, you again. You don't recognize me? Ah, the guy with Matt's orders. Bravo. Report to Meyer in dispatch. The commander is on his way back from the field. Does Matt often go out on field missions? Used to be. He was hardly ever on the ship. Always in the field. Always helping. That's why I joined the Peacekeepers. But lately, Matt's been acting weird. I'm not sure what that's about. It's been this way since before Old Villador and the Renegade attack there. Now this bullshit with the withdrawal, I, I don't get it. Whatever's going on, I hope he addresses the men soon. Helps us understand this bullshit withdrawal. Hmm. He's probably got his reasons. Whatever they are, innocent people are going to get killed. Go see Meyer. Thanks. Report to hey Meyer. Hey, you. Want to be sent back to the outlet? Get that Meyer marker in. In a year, you'll be addressing me as a boy. Hard as you like. Let's open. Hey, where's dispatch? There. 
All right, men. We take care of the UV lamps and head back to base. It should be on point, fast, and easy. Go, go, go! They've already attacked two of our camps. Do everything we can to arm you. If needed, we'll intervene. If you could intervene, why'd you leave in the first place? This is bullshit. Wasn't your father some famous war hero? I bet he's rolling over in his grave. Watch your mouth, civilian. Things are tough all over. You know that. Can I help you? Ah, you. I remember you from the canteen. Yeah, I, I guess. From the fight in the canteen? Uh, maybe. Don't sweat it. You can really hold your own. I respect that. Aiden, right? Commander told me to brief you about faction matters. Missy welcomes you. What did those survivors want? Talking about our little argument? They want what everyone wants. Safety. Which I understand. But we have to keep our eye on the bigger picture here. And it pisses me off when people mention my father. I, I don't mean to pry, but uh, what's the deal with your father? Ugh, this again? Since you're new here, I'll tell you the short version. Classic story. Saved a bunch of his fellow soldiers, some civilians, and got a medal. When was this? Long time ago. Back when people were only fighting each other, and not each other and infected at the same time. So is he why you joined the military? Pretty much. <laughs> he must have been very proud. Sure. Why not? Uh, who's Missy? It's the name of the ship you're standing in. She played a key role during the revolution. Missy was meant to deliver drugs, masks, and other critical medical supplies, then return home. But by then, home was gone. She and her crew had nowhere to go. And what about now? Now, she serves as PK headquarters in Command Central. All directives are issued from right here. Smart. Easier to defend than a building. Exactly. Where is Matt? In the field. He came across a lead in Old Villador. You gotta wait. See that board? I got plenty that needs doing and not enough men. You wanna pick up some of our slack? We pay well. Medic, hurry! Fuck, that's Major Matt. Medic, Something's hurry. happened. Make room! Clear the way! He's bleeding out! Fuck. Oh Hater's in really bad shape. Save him! You Take him me? to the infirmary! Don't Summon the medics! Die. We have to save him. Hang on, Ator. We won't let you go. You hear me? Get moving. Better hope Ader survives. We lost too many people in Old Villador. Jack will do all he can to find out who did this. my husband's fate. Is that why you got a medical degree? To go running to quacks for magic cures? Listen, we don't have medicine. Herbs are our only chance. My husband has fought for you for years. You must get medicine for him, not some herbs that might poison him. <sighs> Time to go, kids. How is he? Ator is strong, but he needs medicine. And that, unfortunately, we don't have. 
We did the best we could with what we have. After the chemical attack, some plants gained healing properties. They worked like an antibiotic. But still, I, people here have strong opinions about healers, but you can hardly blame them. The folk healers give sound advice, but it can prove difficult to follow correctly. Misremember something, gather the wrong herb or use the wrong dosage, and instead of medicine, you administer poison. Which has happened plenty. Because if somebody messes up one of the steps of the recipe, it could kill him. Exactly. But it's enough to listen carefully to the healer's instructions and follow them. The herbalist I know, she's talented. She's Ator's only hope. And what's his wife's problem? Superstitions die hard. Margaret has helped many people everywhere. Some just don't want to admit it. Think I can help? You'd be doing us a big favor. What happened in old Velador is terrible. We've lost so many people. As far as I know, Ator is our only witness. So if he dies, we don't find out what happened there. Exactly. Right, where can I find this healer? On COVID Island. Don't worry. You can trust Margaret. Quartermaster anywhere? You'll fall for my stuff. Hook, line, and sink. Supply can't touch real PK quality. Ain't no barnacles on your wallet. Thanks for selling me your spare. A sound choice. You ain't letting that big one get away. Landed a big one. Do come back and... Supply doing delivering lamps ain't a difficult job. I hope Peter survives. He's one of our most dedicated men. What's the matter? I'm Hugh, and you're the pilgrim who turned on the electricity, right? Word travels fast. Mm -hmm. And word is you you help people. And sometimes. Is that why you called me? I, I need help. My kid went off the water tower earlier and hasn't come back. I'm worried. Uh, how long has he been gone? About six hours now. That's a long time. Wouldn't normally worry. Oh, he's such a strong kid. Built like an ox. But it's been 
such a long time. Hmm. How old's your son? Doesn't matter! I just want my kid back! I would take care of it myself, but... Uh, but there are three young children waiting for me at home. I, I can't leave them unattended. Okay. I'll take a look for you. It's not safe here. Well, let's meet in my place after you found him. It's down on Lower Dam Promenade! Chances against Break Ace were pretty good. But now, I'm not so sure. Hey, you! Want to be sent back to the Outlands? Keep that file. <laughs>
do look pale. Do you think it's caused by the wind? Yeah. <laughs> 